Hi guys, it's me Lane. It is Thursday, the 4th of June, 2015. Um, and it has been a very, very, very long time since I have come to you guys with a video of any sort. Um, yeah, so a lot has happened, um, since the last time I came to you. I actually, I honestly don't know when I made a video last. Um, but yeah, I am still in London, um, and, uh, I will be until the end of September, and that's when I'm going to be flying back to the U.S. Um, so yeah, just some, like, brief little, um, I guess just general updates on my life. Um, I actually am not sure how much I weigh. The last time I weighed myself was a couple days ago, um, and it said I was 206, I think, 203, 206, something like that. I'm not exactly sure, um... I still would like to get below one night, you know, the 200 mark, um, so I'm still aiming for that, but, uh, I'm not stressing too much over it because I am currently wearing the size, between a size 14 and 16 here in the UK, so that's basically like a size 10, 12, something like that in the US. It really depends on the brand, um, but yeah, so I'm, I'm comfortable at where I'm at right now, sorry, my computer's dirty, um, yeah, so that's how I am with my weight loss. Um, so for new guys who are new to my channel or my videos, um, I have vertical sleeve gastrectomy back on August the 28th, 2013, back in Richmond, Virginia, in the U.S. Um, with Dr. John Kellum at the MCV Medical Hospital. However, he has since retired, um, and so he's no longer practicing. But um, he's a great guy. I love him. I'm happy with my surgery and everything. Um, yeah, that's about all I have on that point. Um, as far as school, that is the reason why I am here in London, um, England, that is. Um, I am currently working on my master's degree in history of art, and I have completed three, um, two-thirds of the course. We are um, doing the third part right now, which is working on my final master's dissertation, the big paper. I found out earlier this week that I passed my last two papers, the spring term papers as well, so that means my fall and my spring term papers, I, both, I passed all four of those which I'm very happy with, um, and now all I have to do is pass this and I get my master's, so that's great, um, <laughs> sorry about that, did you just see that, ah, sorry, that was kind of gross, but, um, I have a head cold and it just, ooh. and also, um, I don't know, as I said, I can't remember the last time I, I, um, videoed you guys, but I know it hasn't been since this, but on, um, back on February the 28th, I met, um, someone, who um, is an incredibly sweet and loving guy. Um, his name is Chase, and I literally have seen that boy every single day since we met back on February 28th, and we we started dating basically right away. He is incredible. I love him to pieces, and um, I'm going to be spending the rest of my life with him because on May 2nd, he proposed, and so we're getting married. <laughs> I'm so excited. I can't believe, um, I don't know, he's, he's great. I can't imagine spending my life with anyone else other than him. He's, like, perfect for me. He's from here, he, from here, he's from London. He's born and raised, a London boy. He's great. Um, he's kind of cute because he's a, he has red hair as well, so it's kind of like I ended up with a redhead since I'm a redhead. I just think it's kind of funny, but, um, he is amazing, and I love him so much, and, um, Right now we're in the process of trying to get all his stuff um, together so we can get his, his passport and visa and everything fixed so he can come back with me this summer to the U.S. for a, a while um, because we'd love to get married um, back in the U.S. I mean, I want to get married with my family. And I, I know it's sad for him because his family won't be able to come, but um, he, he wants to get married in the U.S. as well. So that's cool, and then we're going to work on getting his papers um, to get him moved over to the U.S. as well, because he wants to move. So that's super exciting, and that's what's been going on, so with, between him and school, it's been crazy, and I'm a little, also, the really rather knows it's strange days, I'm a little upset just because around two weeks ago, um, my fiance and I um, purchased a little puppy. Um, so if you're friends with me on Facebook or Instagram, you would have seen his picture. Uh, he was beautiful, beautiful. He was, um, eight weeks old, or he was, like, seven weeks when we got him. His name was Fudge, and we named him Fudge, and he was, like, the prettiest little thing in the world, but, um, 
I don't know, we had, we've had some recent um, financial things pop up, and especially with us trying to get him over to the U.S., we realized that we wouldn't be able to take him because of his breed, and financial reasons are, we're, um, we're in a strain of being able to keep him, so unfortunately, this today, we had to sell him, um, we were going to give him back to the original sellers, because they still have his mom and dad, but, um, they were unable to buy him back, um, I, I don't know why, but, um, someone had contacted them wanting one of their puppies, but they'd sold them all, but they, since she knew we were trying to sell, she gave our information to them, and we met them today, and we handed over our little butt. I'm gonna cry again. And we handed them over, so, I'm still trying to deal with that. Uh, I know, it's like you only have them for two weeks, and you fall so in love with them, but he's gonna be taken care of, and... They already told us they're going to keep us up to date, like, they're going to send us pictures and let us know how he's doing, how he's growing, so, that's amazing, and I, I know he'll be safe, and this couple, they're, um, probably, like, in their late 40s, they, um, they, they've they never had any kids, so, Fudge is going to be their, their child, so he's going to be spoiled, which is great, um, but yeah, so that's how that's going, but yeah, other than that, everything's great. <laughs> Ah. Sorry. Yeah. Other than that, everything's great. I'm um, just trying to, um, yeah, finish up this paper, get it all done with, and then spend my last few months here in London. So I can't believe it's been almost a year since I moved over here. Everything's it's gone by so quickly, and I don't know. It's it's crazy. And now that I've met the love of my life, and it, I don't know. It's just coming to London was like the best thing ever. So. <sighs> Yeah, so that's just a brief little update on my life and how things are going. I hope you guys are going well, um, and I hope to be making more videos, um, get back into the swing of things if things are, if things smoothed out with my paper. If I, as long as I am on, keep on track with that, I will be making more videos for you guys. So, I love you all so much. Thank you for watching, and if you to subscribe and see all our videos just hit the button down below um if you liked it please give it a big thumbs up and yeah i'll see you next time okay bye guys